diversification wasn't a choice it was a necessity and I don't believe that anybody that just this is my belief that anybody just prints will survive very passionate about what I do, about print and about manufacture. Uh, we are very excited to engage with our client. We used to uh, term ourselves as um, uh, resin badges, then a digital print and digital manufacture. Now we're saying we don't produce everything, we can produce anything. People are very clever in their strategy. They sent me an array of samples, and the samples kept coming. I began putting the samples up to my client base, and the responses I had were, are you actually manufacturing this now? So I would, I, I would visit the Duplo showrooms, speak to the Duplo staff, personnel, uh, um, engage with them to see what opportunities are there. There are machines sitting there in a corner, which can basically add a vast amount of percentage to your turnover and a vast amount to your capability. And it's only a phone call, it's only a visit to a showroom. Uh, I was enlightened by the showroom. I'm gonna make my third visit very, very shortly to see what else is out there, <laughs> what else I can build on. And I, I, I thoroughly believe that. So we can take the concept and the idea that they've developed for their client, we can develop it into a real world product and then they can go and pitch it to their client. And we sort of work on the principle that, you know, everybody can do the me too, but not many people can do the me only. And the me only is the thing that's going to win you the, uh, win you the contract. We're quite disruptive as a business and the way that we think about things is perhaps a little bit out of the ordinary, uh, a little bit different. Uh, in a nutshell, it's uh, brand enhancement. So uh, everybody, such as myself, is, is passionate about their brand. But if we can portray that brand in, in, in a way that raises it a, a, a above another brand, then it's a worthwhile investment for them. Because once they see the product, they can see the capability and they can see the power of their own brand. So they know quickly and efficiently they can have samples within 48 hours in front of them. And you know, once you engage in the sale, if, if you strike when it's still hot, if you strike when it's, the passion is still there, then they will engage. Um, and so that's what we've built a separate floor just for what we call the, the Duplo event, basically the finishing event. Uh, and that is now key to what we do is sampling. So not only get the sample in front of the client, but the sample, uh, the, the client engaging in the sample construction and they get the whole emotion of the product. So they, they, they have a, an empathic view of, of the processes that go into creating their brand. Um, so the biggest thing for us was the working in partnership um, and also what we've recognised is that the Duplo machines are really simple to use and they're all set up, the interfaces, all the machines are set up very similarly. So you have a bit of training on one machine, you can go over to another machine and recognise it very, very quickly. It's almost plug and play. I mean, I'm, I'm a sales guy, but I've, I've overlooked a lot of the training and all of a sudden I find that I can run these machines as well. So it's nice and simple, nice and intuitive.